Hi guys, you're on warm24.com and today we will disassemble Xiaomi Redmi Note 11 Pro. First of all, we need to take out the card tray. Using a special tool, we take out the dual SIM card tray. Then we have to heat the surface of the back cover up to 70 Celsius degree or 158 degree Fahrenheit. In our case, we use a heating mat. You can use a heat gun. And for 5 or 7 minutes, we heat the surface of the back cover. So, we have warmed the back cover and we can start to open it. For this, we will use a thin plastic film. We put the film in the hole between the middle cover and the back cover and carefully go along the cover, peeling off the adhesive base. There is no much under the cover, but you will still have to be careful. And we can open the back cover. There is nothing on the back cover except the camera's cover. After that, we can unscrew the screws at the top. For this, we use a Philips H3O screwdriver, 1.5 mm. The screws are all the same. And then we unscrew the screws at the bottom. Some screws might get stuck in the cover, but that is ok, we can take them out after we detach the middle cover. And we move on to removing the middle cover. It is attached with a clips, so we take a thin plastic tool or plastic film Go along with the tool and detach the middle cover. We have to be careful around the fingerprint sensor and the side buttons, so we don't damage anything. We open the middle cover carefully without any damage to the fingerprint sensor cable. And we disconnect the two battery connectors and we can disconnect the connector of the fingerprint sensor cable. On the middle cover we have the antenna contact pads, transmission lines and the fingerprint sensor. We also have to unscrew one screw that holds the speaker assembly in the place. We disconnect the coaxial cable connector and disconnect the interboard cable connector. We detach the speaker assembly. Now we can remove the subboard. The subboard is lightly glued, carefully remove it. On the subboard we have the charging port, the cards holder and the microphone on the back side. And we disconnect the interboard cable connector, display connector and the coaxial cable connector. After that we disconnect and take out the front camera. It is slightly glued to the motherboard shield with a copper foil. We disconnect the connectors and take out the large back camera and the two laser ones. The base of one camera is glued to the display frame, so we will remove it after we detach the motherboard. We pick up by the edges, check the connectors, hooks, clips, then nothing is holding and take the motherboard out. Then we can gently pick up at the base and remove the rear camera. Yeah. 
All we have to do is to detach the battery and we have to pull the brown tab up. And as we can see, the battery pulled it off easily and on the display frame are tracks of non-original adhesive. Someone has changed the battery before us. And this is the end of this disassembly. Thank you for watching and see you around. Okay guys, now we're done. Thank you for watching. If you like what we do, please consider subscribing to our YouTube channel or read our articles on our website. Take care of yourself and until next video.